I think you must realize that some people are going to go to your show at the planetarium and they're going to say, aha, those scientists have discovered God because God, dark matter, is what holds this universe together. Was that a question? <laughs> it's a statement. You know. It's you know they're going to so, say that. So the history of discovery, particularly cosmic discovery, but discovery in general, scientific discovery, is one where at any given moment there's a frontier. And there tends to be an urge for people, especially religious people, to assert that across that boundary into the unknown, lies the handiwork of God. This shows up a lot. This, over time, has been described by philosophers as the God of the gaps. Mm -hmm. if, if that's how you, if that's where you're gonna put your God in this world, then God is an ever receding pocket of scientific ignorance. If that's how you're gonna invoke God, if God is the mystery of the universe, these mysteries, we're, t we're tackling these, Mysteries, one by one. If you're going to stay religious at the end of the conversation, God has to be more to you than just where science has yet to tread.